And just like that, our first semifinal has concluded. Allegiance walking away with a 2-0 victory. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Fowler Series presented by AT&T. My name is Bill Jump Carter. Join with me. I've got Sui J and Paul Inviram. Uh, I'm, I'm Batman. What? I don't, I'm, I'm Batman. Okay, look. I understand my voice is going out, but this is not your regular voice. It's, it's not who I am uh, underneath, but what I do that defines me. You could have at least tried a little bit harder. He's not even out in North America, Paul. We have him over in Europe, but he's not in North America. It's the wrong block. I'm, I'm the hero that Gotham deserves. No, we're not even in Gotham. We're in Los Angeles, Paul. Yeah, and your jungle is, is rough, man. Look, it's, I'm all about early game rotations. Okay? No, I, I can't. No, I'm done. I'm over it. I've tried and I've tried, but this is the last straw. Get off my set now. Paul, I swear to God, no. if you... You swear to me! There comes a time in every production where things go wrong and you have to be the one to fix it. That time is now. Over the last couple weeks, I've consulted with the top esports technicians and we have come up with this. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Cybercore button. This button is to do what the Valor series deserves. There is only one person that I trust, respect, and value enough to have two of. Ladies and gentlemen, today we clone Suijay. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Intel Esports Arena, where we have our second semifinal of the day. My name is Bill Jump Carter. Join with me. I've got Jeffrey Sui J. Chow and Jeffrey Sui J. Chow. How are we doing, gentlemen? I'm, I'm doing, doing well. well. This, this seems, seems better. better. <sighs> it seems so much better. I can breathe. I might not have a voice, but at least I can relax. Now, Sui J, as we have two of you, this will be much more smoother than anticipated. We have Immortals taking on the Dino Riders. Talk to me about this matchup. Yeah, this is the matchup that I'm super excited for because Dino Riders, they did so well. They took a game off Immortals last week. They almost took game two. And Immortals looking very strong as well. So this is going to be a very interesting match. Yes, I'm very excited to see KZ Fox back on the roster the second week together and seeing the growing synergy with the Immortals team. Both of these teams are looking to get themselves on a momentous streak going into E3. Let's talk about this Immortals roster first. Now, we have had Dave and Neo being added to the roster, but even with the new additions, it seems that they are steamrolling all the same. Yeah, Big's playing on this. Teamy, his silent Wonder Woman. Dave played Steffi's great in jungle. I mean, the whole team had just great synergy. And Neo, aggressive Jinnar and Teamy game two as well. And you have to see Dave and Neo in the mid lane combo. Will they be supporting the aggressive invades and doing these sideline ganks? I love the analysis. It's absolutely fantastic. So let's go ahead and kick ourselves to our second roster. That's going to be the Dino Riders. Not only have they got themselves an updated logo, but more importantly, they are looking to bring things together for E3. Yeah, Dino Riders look so strong. CLZ played the Flash Jungle. Yikes on this whips. I mean, who and also this Raz is they're so aggressive and medic. Great Argent landing a lot of skill shots. And CLZ looks stronger and stronger every week. And over here, Medic was MVP in the last game. And he's the play to be the player to watch this time. Players to watch indeed. And of course, having such expert analogy, uh, analysis with two Sweejays, it's going to make the next question even easier. Sweejay, who are we expecting to win this match? It's going to be such a close matchup, but I got to give it to Immortals because they have shown time and time again that they come out in the end. And that's exactly what they did against Dino Riders, and I think it will be the same outcome. I mean, Immortals is the favorite to win, but I have to disagree with myself here. Dino Riders look stronger and stronger week after week. They made Immortals feel like mortals by taking one decisive game and making them struggle the second game. Hey, and I'm rooting for hey, an underdog hey. here. I'm rooting for an underdog here. Hey, this is not cool. My win percentage <laughs> is at stake, man. I'm trying to, to help the win percentage I here. 90%. I'm trying to help the win percentage. No, this is not I, cool. I've, junk, I've made, junk. I've Unacceptable. Made, I've made a grave mistake. I thought having two analytical minds of this caliber, identical minds would be a benefit 
But alas, unfortunately, it is nothing but a negative, as even the same brain can't or even think about having themselves a winner. So Twitch chat, it's all up to you. Who do you feel is going to win this match? Is it going to be Immortals? Is it going to be Dino Riders? And more importantly, the question becomes, and I can't believe I'm saying this, where is Paul? I, despite the mockery, despite the unbelievable desire to mock my accent and pretend to be Batman, I need my play-by-play, -play. I need him here. It seems that he's finally back. Welcome back, sir. How are you? Uh, I'm doing so. I ran into Batman in the back. Like it was awesome. I'm sorry. I'm like I just sounds so good. Hey, just... you got to ride in a Batmobile? No, no it was, it was just, dope. just no. Please, I can't. 